Alrighty guys, what is going up? Welcome back to the Best Investing Money Management channel on YouTube. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the top cryptocurrency ETF. Now, the reason why I personally love ETFs is because you get a variety of different companies. Instead of picking and choosing, you know, the best stocks, you can pretty much just invest in the general sector and if one or two or three stocks in that ETF are good, then the, it, that will definitely boost this ETF up. But in today's video, we are going to be looking at the top three blockchain, Bitcoin, or cryptocurrencies ETFs for this year. Now, there's been so much hype about these cryptos, right? We've seen Bitcoin go all the way up to almost 70 thousand dollars per coin when a couple years ago you could have bought it for three thousand dollars so there is a ton of buying pressure behind that but on the flip side how can you invest in the blockchain on the stock market so one of the best ways is through etf investing so for me the best etf out there is blok block now this is pretty much a blockchain ETF. You guys can see it has a beautiful growth. Year to date, you guys could you guys could have sold this and been up 160%, but if you didn't and you just bought a year ago, you're up roughly 102%. You know, which in my opinion is absolutely crazy, right? This holds a variety of stocks from MicroStrategy, Square, uh, AMD, NVIDIA, companies that are heavily invested in the blockchain. The expense ratio is around 0.71, which that's pretty fair for this amount of growth, right? You know, a stock going up 100% is going to have a little higher uh, expense ratio compared to like the S&P 500 ETF. But this is still an amazing ETF that I would highly recommend. Now, the second one that is still pretty good, but it only has around a 38 uh, percent performance is B L C N. Now this one here, you guys can see it has a beautiful upward trend over the past year. It's still outperformed the market, but it's only going up 38% and it still has a decent uh, expense ratio at around 0 0.68. So it's still pretty high, but you're getting almost a 40% return on your money. This one does have a variety of um, of value and growth stocks that are both optimizing and investing in the blockchain as well as multiple holdings of coinbase that is another uh, cryptocurrency exchange uh, platform as well as shares of micro strategy square very similar to the other ones but this one will have a blend of more value rather than growth okay now the last one that we're really going to look at is still one that is a actively um, invested blockchain ETF. Now the ticker for this is going to be L-E-G-R. Whoops, L-E-G-R. So you guys can see this one does have a beautiful growth. The volatility for this one is going to be a lot lower than the previous three, but this one does have a return of 36% with the lowest expense ratio at around 0 0.65, but you only get that 36% return each um year now the top holding for this one is nvidia uh amd oracle um a variety of companies that are more in the tech world on the blockchain rather than companies that are more invested in it and work with it so this is still an amazing etf but me personally i think really the top ones is going to be uh block b l um okay is going to be like the higher risk higher reward Okay, this is going to be one that's going to be more volatile. You guys can see it goes up and down at rapid rates, but you're going to get a better return out of it. One that's going to have a blend of both growth and value stocks is going to be BLCN. This is going to have more uh, volatility, you guys can see, but it still has a lot of value stocks to keep this going um, up. But the last one, this one's just going to be a blend of mostly value stocks, a lot more blue chip companies that are going to grow and it's going to be a lot lower risk, um, lower returns, all of that. These are the top three uh, blockchain, Bitcoin, cryptocurrency, ETFs 
that you guys can use to pretty much invest in the blockchain, but invest with the stock market. So I'd highly recommend putting these ETFs in your, you know, in your portfolio so you guys can have them, save them, add them to your watch list. Fantastic strategy for this would be dollar cost averaging so you guys can get a good average price for your shares. So that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, hit that like button and subscribe. And we will see you guys later. Remember to stay happy, stay positive, and stay safe out there. Take care.